When Jalil Bowens told marketing and communications manager at Lime Karim National Hall, he did not have a cellular phone. Little did he know he would soon have to choose between a Samsung S5 or an Apple iPhone. Jalil was among a few lucky aesthetic students and teachers to take home top-of-the-line cell phones when manager at Lime Sean O'Geese and his team launched the Lime Surprise Program at the Brigada Flax Educational Center on Wednesday, April 23rd. So today, we are here to give this young man a food. Now, I know he was harassing Karim this morning, so I know if he's out there, he knows exactly who he is. Can I invite Jalil Baron, the iPhone 5S, or, or the brand new Galaxy S5? Khadija Roberts, Joanna Gibson, and debate coach and teacher Yulet Evelyn each received an iPhone 5S device for taking the school into the 2004 secondary school debate finals. Four other teachers were given Alcatel One Touch Idol phones and two other students also received phones, taking the total phones given away to 10. But the surprises kept coming. Fifth and fourth form students who visited Lyme in February as part of the Brigada Flax Educational Center's career development field tours were also invited to lunch at the Top of the Bats restaurant. After lunch, Jalil Bowens told JTV News what was going through his mind as he contemplated whether to choose the Samsung or the Apple. It was a good feeling because those were the two top phones on the market. And for me to get an opportunity to choose one, it was a really nice feeling. I, would be, I was happy, I was happy. I chose that Galaxy S5. Well, my challenge was to show students and people how to use a phone and be safe while using it. That was my challenge and I have to do stuff and write stuff about how to do that. You think you're up to that challenge? What do you think you're going to do? I don't have a clue yet what I have to do. I just get help on how to do it. The first execution of the Once in a Lifetime program that promises to bring joy to persons across the territory created much excitement when the Brigada Flax Educational Center held its first General Assembly on the resumption of school following the Easter holidays. Fourth form student at Brigada Flax Educational Center, Eddie Cupid, was recognized as one of the newest Lyme ambassadors. It is a role that he hopes to benefit from. Well, basically, for Lime, a Lime ambassador, we just we do commercial promote Lime. If they bring something like this, well, they have their new effect, Lime Surprise, where they go around, surprise people with new stuff like phones. Meanwhile, principal at the Brigada Flax Educational Center, Carol O'Neill, says Lime Surprise is a welcome incentive for the students. She says the initiative is one way of telling the students that there are people out there who care about them. The Brigada Flax Educational Center's secondary division has a population of 240 students and is staffed with 30 teachers.